what's going on guys today i bring you another destiny video and today i'm going to show you guys how you can glitch in to the water glass if you want to do this solo and pick up the new added exotic chest uh, where it has a chance of an exotic to drop for you now it's actually quite easy and quite simple now if you guys do enjoy the video leaving a like is much much appreciated and as always guys to be in with a chance of winning my weekly resurrectionist emblem giveaway simply leave a comment on the video okay so if you don't know about this already i mean a lot of people made a video about this chest last week me included there has been a new chest added to the vault of glass and it's actually quite easy to do between the actual starting stages and the templar there's a secret path if you didn't know about that already it's actually located on that secret path and in today's video i'll show you guys how you can glitch in you don't have to do the first part of the raid you can glitch straight through to the door and go and get this uh, actual chest it's easy and simple this week the featured raid is the vault of glass we've got two challenges we've got the templar challenge and we've got the atheon challenge the templar challenge is basically not to allow him to teleport and the atheon challenge is basically when you're at the stages where you have to open up portals and go into the actual portals and kill oracles what you have to do here is one person kills one oracle per run it's as simple as that one person dies you wipe and try again but one person kills one oracle each run so you're going in probably a team of two or three you'll kill one oracle each you'll go back out and the people standing on the pads opening up the portals need to go in and kill their oracles it's that simple okay so to get this exotic chest you want to load up the water glass raid as i've done um, basically as soon as you spawn in you want to jump on your sparrow you want to go up to the main door you want to approach it to your left you want to ignore all the enemies just go up to the door and you kind of want to approach it like i am you want to kind of like glitch in wedge yourself into the door and then simply jump off your sparrow it's that easy once you've done that, you want to make your way down to where you'll see the first chest, which actually won't be here because you haven't actually done the first part of the raid. Uh, so once you're here, you want to jump down to where I go, follow my lead to the secret path. If you didn't know about this already, it's pretty fucking epic. Now, once you're down here, just follow my lead, take the direction I take, and you will come to the secret new added seventh exotic chest, where, like I said, you will have a chance of an exotic to drop for you, as I did on my top. Uh, Titan. I didn't get one on my Hunter, but I did get one on my Titan, and I'm yet to do it on my Warlock. And it's that simple, guys. A free exotic each week. Uh, well, there's a chance of a free exotic each week. You might as well go and get it. It drops up to max light as well. As you can see, my one is a 400 light level, so that's pretty fucking epic. But, guys, that is it for another video. If any more secrets come forward, I'll have you guys covered here on my channel. So, subscribe if you're new around here. Hit that bell button, it's that subscribe button to turn on notifications so when I upload, so you never miss a video. And as always, guys, I will catch you on that next one.